this video, I am going to explain planetary gear, how we can draw the planetary gear. Just click the new model and uh, type the model name that is the planetary underscore gear. The planetary gear I want to create. The planetary underscore gear and click apply and click OK. Then that name will be displayed. Let's see that planetary gear. Go to this uh, point table, click the point table and create here I want one shaft the two points sufficient I am taking the uh, uh, Z is a hundred and a minus hundred remaining X and Y zero zero apply and click OK now you can see that you can uh, zoom and uh, fit to the window then go for the shaft radius I am taking the 10 so enter the 10 then select the, uh, this point and that point the shaft is created and converted into the uh, solid model um, then we will go for the connectors Okay, here revolute joint, click the revolute joint and click the part 2 and ground and select the portion of the joint and joint is created. Now we want to create the planetary gear. Okay. For creating the planetary gear, just go for the missionary. That by default, that planetary gear option is there. All these uh, planetary the entire set uh, will be created at a time. Okay, so you need not create the separate uh, gears. Now we go for the detailed option, click next. Now you can see that here sun gear, ring gear and planetary gear. So now I am using the planetary gear, different options are there. First we will see the three planetary gears. And the, uh, the data, number of teeth 42, 78, 18. All the data will be, keep it in same days. Then go to the next, all the, these properties available. Now you can make it sun gear is a fixed gear. Then we can assign this to the existing and ground and assign to the, the part 2 the part 2 is assigned then planetary gear planetary gear is rotational it's rotating and the ring gear ring gear is existing that also you can assign to the part 2 so once your assignment is over then you can click and finish then that entire assemble unit will be created and mounted on the shaft let us see that now see entire the planetary setup will be created and mounted on the shaft so now this uh, we are assigning the revolute joint now go for the motion okay for that joint you can give the motion here rotational speed that is given you can now select the joint joint is at uh, the center joint one click so that motion is assigned so once motion is assigned then you can verify the results or the simulation how it is a simulation is a possible to click the simulation icon then you can uh, Select here uh, the option is uh, forever and I am uh, step size I am keeping 0 0.01 for a slow speed and verify the results model verified successfully close it and start uh, uh, the uh, simulation. Now you can see that uh, all the wheels uh, that the sun wheel is rotating and the planetary wheels are also rotating uh, around this uh, fixed angular wheel. So for you can you can clearly observe the sun gear and planetary gear are both are meshing externally. Both are rotating in opposite direction. Whereas planetary and this is in opposite, annular is inside. Now let us see that we are analyzing, loading these graphs also. Just select the objects. Now you can select the body, part 2, which want to uh, velocity, magnitude, and add curve. Okay, now let us go for the next option. Anything you want, you can select it and uh, let us see acceleration, add the curves, like multiple curves you can add. Now let us see the second uh, window and uh, created uh, um, the part 2. I want to go for this angular velocity option, select magnitude and add curves, that angular option will be created. So likewise, you can uh, create uh, the several uh, analysis, you can do it. You can analyze the uh, things uh, using this uh, software. Okay. It's very much useful for the different points and different settings you can create and you can analyze velocity accelerations. It's very much useful in this Adam software.